Here's the subway scene you may remember that I modeled a while ago in quite a long series of videos. And what my plan is here is to use the Blender add-on, the paid Blender add-on, $30 US, uh, Smudger Pro, to try and uh, do textures, materials uh, for this. I might use a combination of Smudger, Substance Painter, Blender itself, we'll see. But I just uh, wanted to show you the process. So I'm willing to <laughs> experiment on camera here. Uh, and so if you have tips on using it, that's, uh, that's great. That could be helpful. Uh, I'm going to do this kind of quick. And so um, some of the materials may not be that good on camera. And uh, let me go back and adjust it once I have a better idea. There's a lot, there's a lot of stuff going on here. Um, I'm going to focus on the desk fan here. And I'm going to control click that stuff and just zoom in on, on this guy itself. I'll switch over to look dev and um, go to the world tab. And I want to change my HDR to some sort of interior scene and have this quite low. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to click on the materials tab. I'll pull this out a little bit. And I've got just ambient material here. I'm going to click new. And I'm going to call this uh, fan gold metal. And I'm going to come down under here, fan gold metal. And you can see that Smudger Pro is integrated into the materials uh, panel. I'm going to make this slot active. And, and it says this material does not yet have a smudger setup. Add a smudger setup. Let's we'll start with scratches. And I'm going to click add scratches. And then I see some choices. So I'm just going to leave it on that one for now. And I'm going to come over to the shading tab. Select that. Press the period key to zoom in. And make sure we're on look dev. And you can see here that it's created some nodes. We've got that principal BSDF and material output, uh, smudger here, the smudger catcher. What I'm gonna do in here is I'm gonna change this color to sort of a kind of a goldy color here. I come in here, I'm oh, sorry, on this guy, and I'm gonna sign that. Oh, I don't need to do that. Okay, now let's see if we can see a few scratches in here. Okay, I don't know how well you can see that. Now, if I come down again, here, let's first of all, I'm going to slide the metallic all the way up, and that's going to help. Okay, see the scratches? No, like that. <clears throat> so we got some scratches in there. All right. And now we're going to oops, let's add some dust. Add dust. A little update. And we get some dust. Maybe I like that one better. Under the multiplier, I can have less or more. So let's say just go for three. Uh, let's add a bit of side dust. Let's go to 0 0.3. Puts a little bit there. Okay. And we can see it's now added the dust stuff. I'm going to change this to 0 0.3. Okay. Let's try some smudges. Add smudges. Okay. It's done this one. <clears throat> Let's try some of this stuff. All right. Let's say that was what we were going to go for for now. 
let's just try that for now. Let's select this. And we'll come up here and we'll choose that. I'm going to choose that for a lot of this here. Okay, do some more work on that in a bit. And let's come over to here to this stuff. Let's close that up a bit. Let's create a new one. Let's call this fan silver metal. And let's make this metallic first of all. Okay. Make it active. Add a smudger setup. Let's do scratches. Let's do dust. I'm just going to leave it like that for now. And let's add a bit of smudges. Okay. Let's go to the shading tab. And under here, we change this 0 0.3. And let's take these guys. And let's call this fan green buttons or something make that active add a smudger setup we'll do some scratches and uh, let's change the clip to 0 0.001 so it never clips again let's shade those uh, smooth and so let's say there's some scratches but let's come over here and um, I want to get this Kind of green, uh, green color. Yeah, and we'll go for a zero point two. Sort of shiny buttons, but we're gonna add some dust. Okay. Let's go for um, three, and we'll put a little bit of side dust on there. And I was thinking of doing this as well. I don't know if it'll look any good. We'll give it a try. Uh, let's make another slot and choose that side. Uh, that's kind of what I was thinking of for that fan. Okay, for the time being, let's go with it. Now, let's move on and do a few things here real quick. So we got the desk fan. Let's check out the desk as well. And I'm gonna do a slightly different thing for the desk. And let's just do U, let's just use Smart UV Project 0.02. Uh, let's see if I can just do that. I come over to UV image editor. I got everything there. And where's my death? There it is. Zoom in on this and switch over to look dev. And I'm gonna open up a wood texture. I'm gonna use this one. And this is new. I'll call this a desk wood assign this and the shading tab just go bring in a typical texture that would put it in there Just get rid of all this, get rid of the ambient occlusion on everything. And um, we'll set all this up. And then we'll have a look and see how well it's you feed.
this wood already has some imperfections. So. Okay, so I'm going to try this part again. And that'll make those look a little bit better. Let's just double check some of these things. It might have been better to not do them all together. Mm, I don't really like that. I'm okay with that for now. Let's just try this one. No, all right, whatever. Good enough. Okay. I might want to do that itself. Okay, so we have this. And let's add some smudger stuff on this. Okay, let's make it the yeah, it's active. So I'll add a smudger setup. Let's add some scratches to this. I don't know how well you can see that a little bit there. Okay. We'll add some dust. <laughs> you can see that there. Okay, so let's let's not go so crazy with the dust. Let's just have a look at this. I'm not messing around with this wood uh, right now with the bump and uh, and all of that stuff. I'm just doing this real quick. Okay, so it's coming through. It's coming through nicely and it's looking rather warm. All right, so this is what we get. So that's, I'm, I'm fine with this so far. Let's get some chairs going here. Go side to side, I'm okay with that for now. I don't want to take too much of your time. Let's find that desk lamp now. There it is, desk lamp. Let's bring that in. And let's try just throwing on some of that same gold material here. You know, if you just wanted to build up the scene quickly and not spend too much time, you know, doing each material. All right. Might be tiled a little bit. I have to look at that sometime. I'm not going to see it that closely. Okay, let's grab this though. Let's create new. And this is going to be um, emission lamp. I'll call this. No emission desk lamp. So I may have a few different emissions. And under surface, we will choose emission. And we'll make this 15. And just a little bit more like that. We'll try that. Um, and I do actually think I want a light, uh, a point light kind of close to this. Uh, let's see what that's 
Uh, we'll see. Let's try this, just so we can see it. Okay, so that's what it looks like so far. Let me quickly build up this scene. I'm going to do one more piece here. Uh, I'm going to actually get rid of that. I'm going to do one more piece, and then we'll leave it at that for the time being. And that's going to be the ashtray. There it is. All right, cool. So let's go back to medium point on that. And let's, uh, what do we want to do here? We're going to come in here. Let's create a new material. New material. This is going to be ashtray. Let's make that the active slot. Add a smudger setup. Let's do some scratches and uh, add scratches. Let's uh, come over here first of all. And where's my, where's my ashtray there? And under here, I want this to be like kind of black. See, now you can see the scratches. Let's make this a 0 0.25. Might be too much, we'll see. And we'll add some dust. Add a bit of dust. Let's not have too much though. Let's try two. Yeah. Smudges. Add some smudges. Let's see, not that one. I don't know. That one. And let's uh, lower that down, that down. All right, let's see, that's my ashtray. Actually, I think the scratches are too much. Um, strength, zero point, what was it, zero point two? Zero point one. It looks more like leather, really. Um, so I'm going to try a shot from here, and I think we're going to leave it at that for now. Um, however, let's just have a look. Okay, so I got a sun. Let's get rid of that, and that's probably one thing that's been bothering me. So there's one view of my uh, desk and chairs, my desk fan, the ashtray, and the lamp. I'll show you one other view. And there's another view of it. So I'm liking it so far, and I think I'll continue with uh, making the materials uh, in Smudger, tweaking them as I go along. All right, thanks for watching.